Hey YouTube, it's Michael Lambert here. I'm back once again with another reaction video. Once again, I'm reacting to the endorsement in this video, Whole Foods Cheese Pizza Review. Best or worst pizza deal. The endorsement. This is the new one that he uploaded yesterday and I'm going to react to it right now. And if any notifications pop up during the video... I apologize, and I will take care of them. Now, let's get to this video. All right, so listen. I've been wanting to do this for a while. Uh, a little while ago, a year or two ago, something like that, I finally reviewed uh, Whole Foods Pizza, but I got a slice of pizza, and I had some comments that said, no, 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 you got to go and get the whole pizza, get it made fresh. So I got there early, and they have a deal, $12. I saw the sign for a large cheese pizza. I already looked at it. It looks amazing. It smells amazing. And for $12, this size pizza, look at this. What is this? 20 inch? 18 inch? All right, we're going to check it out. Cue the intro. <laughs> What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. All right, Whole Foods Pizza has some people lighting up a... Somehow uh, lighting up a, uh, not a cigarette, right next to me, just pulled in. I get it, there's shade over here, but they said, what's this guy doing with a pizza? We're going to get... Uh, where they get mellow over to the side of this guy and uh, watch him uh, film a review. So let me not uh, get distracted. This smells good. I don't remember if I enjoyed that slice. The slices are like $3.99, like $4. And if you add it up, eight slices and a pie, that's $32. Why would anyone buy a slice? Just get the cheese pizza. There it is right there. I got some B-roll, so I'll get you uh, some close-up uh, looks at this. But I am a fan of how it looks. I like these, like, pockets, these little, like, air bubbles right there. So I like it. It smells good, but it is hot out of the oven. I appreciate the uh, customer service as well. It had a sign in there that said uh, pizza starts at 11 o'clock. And um, I said, hey, do I have to wait till 11 o'clock uh, to make a pizza? She's like, I got Got you and she hooked me up with this pizza so i think it's like 10 30 a.m i'm eating a pizza from whole foods let's check it out all right we are going to check it out they sliced it nice look at the undercarriage right there nice char on the bottom right there very nice uh layering of cheese got the pockets like i said there's another little close-up look at it all right wish me luck a large cheese pizza that big for twelve dollars wawa are you watching <laughs> i think the wawa pizza is smaller the wawa pizza was no bueno i think uh they're advertising that more because i'm getting more uh comments and hits on my wawa pizza review but we're not here to talk about wawa we're here to talk about whole foods and here we go oh also i'm like let me try something while i'm in here if you know whole foods they got a lot of um i don't know different items i got this waterloo sparkling water blackberry lemonade so i'm gonna try this with the pizza a little bonus review, I guess. All right, wow. it's uh, ready to go. It's hot and ready. Let's go. That is worth every penny of that $12. Is it great? No. Is it going to rival New York pizzerias, Boston pizzerias, Detroit pizzerias, Chicago pizzerias, New Haven, did I mention that? Pizzerias. No. But for $12, it tastes really good. The texture of this uh, crust is good as well. It does not seem like a uh, glorified frozen pizza like a lot of these places do. Wawa. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Wawa taking some shrapnel in this uh, Whole Foods review. Mm. Quality cheese. Nice flavor to the mozzarella. Mm. 
Yeah. All right, um, that's really good. Great amount of cheese, nice crunch and texture of the um, crust. The sauce, a little bit to be desired. It's not sweet, it's not savory. I mean, it's good, a very nice uh, tomato flavor. It's definitely different. It's something that uh, I'm not used to in some of these uh, pizza spots out here. Waterloo sparkling water, blackberry lemonade. Let's go. Not bad. If you watch the channel enough, you know I'm not a huge fan of um, sparkling waters, uh, low-cal drinks, things of that nature. Uh, but I wanted to keep it semi-healthy as I am uh, gorging on a large cheese pizza. Maybe I should offer uh, the people next to me who are um, enjoying a little puff puff, see if they want a slice. Yeah. All right, so that's pretty good. One to 100 on that drink, I'd give it like an 80. Uh, you know, I'm not a huge fan of those types of drinks. Wow. Uh, so here we go. I like it. The thing is huge. Um, I have to give it a rating because that's what we do over here. One to 100, this pizza is going to get a solid, especially for the price. I'm going to give it an 86, a solid 86. Wow. It's probably a little wow. low because it does have all the components I like. A nice undercarriage, got some bubble in the crust, great amount of cheese. I'm going to change it. I rarely do that, but I'm going to give it an 88. I'm going to give it an 88. I wow. really do enjoy it. There is some room for improvement, but at the same time, I really enjoy it. Mm. All right, so I had to turn the car on, get a little uh, air condition. Let me give you one more look. Light up the comments below on what you think of Whole Foods Pizza. Is this score too low? Is it too high? Are you on board with me that a $12 pizza signed me up all day? Definitely light up the comments. Let me know what you think about this pizza. Like I said, the slices are 3 or $4. So you're talking $24 to $32 if you bought eight slices. You definitely need to get the uh, pizza for $12. It is a no-brainer. Three words, no-brain-er. All right, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media, getting the word on my channel out to the masses. In closing, there you go. Um, I revisited Whole Foods. I got this uh, Waterloo drink, and I also got uh, a couple more of these. I think I've showed you these in the past. Uh, I got the hand sanitizer, ruby grapefruit. Wow. Check it out right there. All right, so this video um, jam-packed with items. Hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you soon with some more reviews. Bye. <sighs>
And I know a notification has popped up, but this video is almost over anyway, so I'll take care of it afterwards. And I'm off now, so until next time, see ya!